Theodosia writes me a letter every day. Hey, what's going on, guys? I'm keeping her bed warm while her husband is away. Hey, what's going on, guys? Oh. He's on the British side in Georgia. He's trying to keep the colonies in line. Well, he can keep all of Georgia. Theodosia, she's mine. Love doesn't discriminate between the sinners and the saints. It takes and it takes and it takes and we keep loving anyway. We laugh and we cry and we break and we make our mistakes. And if there's a reason I'm by her side and so many have tried, then I'm willing to wait for it. I'm willing to wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. My grandfather was a fire and brimstone preacher. But there are things that the homilies and hymns won't teach you. My mother was a genius. My father commanded respect. When they died, they left no instructions, just a legacy to protect. Death doesn't discriminate between the sinners and the saints. It takes and it takes and it takes, and we keep living anyway. We rise and we fall and we break and we make our mistakes. And if there's a reason I'm still alive, when everyone who loves me has died, I'm willing to wait for it. Wait for it. I'm willing to wait for it. Like in his shoes Hamilton doesn't hesitate He exhibits no restraint Takes and he takes and he takes And he keeps winning anyway Changes the game Plays and he raises the stakes And if there's a reason He seems to thrive and so few survive Then God damn it, I'm willing to wait for it I'm willing to wait for it Life doesn't discriminate something I would like to say. Uh, so there's something that's going down once the school year starts, and that is that uh, the people of like my Overwatch group, not like Dauntless, but like Lack, Omar, Otto, uh, kind of like Kirby, but Kirby's not really involved with this, uh, most of us have agreed that we are not going to play the game as much anymore, and the reason is for this is because the reason why we play the game is we play the game because of each other, I guess. It's because we're kind of like a group of friends, you know, like, you know, touchy little stuff. No. But anyways, no. When school starts, it's becoming our junior year, me, like, and autos. And so we have decided that we honestly need to start focusing. We need to do, like, extracurricular activities. I haven't done too much the past years, but, you know, uh, I've done a couple, but I kind of want to exceed. I want to uh, exceed the requirements that I need for, um, you know, extracurricular activities. And I want to do more things. I want to have more time for other things. And it's not like, oh, yeah, the, the thing is, is the game's distracting, right? So I do have the time. It's just like I choose to do the game over the other thing. And the game's distracting. And it honestly keeps me up all night. Discord keeps me up, like, all day and all night. And it's ridiculous how much it actually uh does to you but uh see i'm sorry for the bad editing i mean it wasn't the best i tried to do some some type of velocity i don't i don't know it was just kind of like i trying to i wanted to fit the clips with like the song and yeah, the song is not your average Minecraft song. It actually comes from a play called Hamilton that I hope most of you have heard of. It's a great play. I've been obsessed with it. And even if you're not like a play Broadway person, it's not like that 
average Broadway, as you can probably hear from the song. It's not, uh, I, I don't know how to explain it, but it, it's kind of like modern songs, you know, and that it's what they're going for, you know, so. So yeah, in the song, it states, like, I am the only person I can control. And of course, that's true, but over the years, I haven't made the best choices. I've stuck to the game, and you know, um, I've planned to quit, but I don't really have that self-control. And you know, I make good grades in school, so that's not the problem. But you know, I already explained earlier, I wanted to do more. So basically, it kind of just speaks to me. In the song, it also states about falling behind and... I guess I have kind of fallen behind when it comes to comparing on what I do that will help me get into colleges versus what other people are doing. So I feel like this song just kind of speaks to what I'm trying to do. Like, I kind of just want to get out of the shell of being on my computer, you know, and I want to branch out. I want to do more things. And so, yeah, I just want to say before that I end the video... Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for the three years on YouTube and the four years from all the Dauntless people. I applaud Vile, Jack, Ace, and I think Meepo was recently promoted to Dauntless Leader. I um, applaud all of them for the past year for taking care of Dauntless for me, keeping it alive. Because right now, Dauntless is most definitely the longest clan to at least be together. Every I don't think there's a clan that's been together for four years now. Four years is a long time. A long time. Um, it was before the 2014 Bridges Tournament, before we formed 2013. About to come up to four years. That's incredible. And the channel's been alive for about three years, I believe. And um, it's been an experience ever since. And what sets me and most of the people in Dallas YT different from other YouTubers is... We don't do this for money. There's no profit. We don't monetize our stuff, and everything is for the enjoyment, for the community, for you guys. And the thing that always kept us motivated was, the, or what kept me motivated was, you know, your subscribes, the likes, the comments, and everything else, and the recognition in the community. Building the communities honestly always kept me there. And it, it's great, because over three years, I've actually accomplished something, I guess, on the game. I've created a better community for Mindplex. Um, hopefully, I had a decent impact on it. But yeah, just would like to thank you guys. You guys are honestly great. For the people who actually stuck around for the past three years are even more incredible. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I guess... Uh, before I end this off, we are not quitting. I should have mentioned this earlier. We aren't quitting. We're kind of just like not playing as much, you know. We're not like consistently getting on uh, weekdays for X amount of hours, right? We're just going to be playing for fun like when we want to kind of thing. So that's going to be cool. Anyways, I guess this is Duck MC, one of Dauntless YT's or one of my final videos. I guess this is me signing out. Peace out, guys.